Jessica Gaines Jabo has more clarity, more energy, more confidence, and more connection of knowing what she wants in life after completing 90 days straight of alcohol freedom. Hello, Jessica. Hi. How do you feel? I feel amazing. I feel very, very good. I love it. You've just completed Project 90, which is the program that we have to help entrepreneurs and business owners quit drinking for 90 straight days and beyond. Have you gone back yeah. to drinking since you completed your 90 no. days? No, I'm not looking back. How many days are you now? Oh my gosh, good question. I would say I'm probably 105. I'm not even, I kind it's of quit counting. counting. 60. It's like, it feels like a lifetime ago in a good way. Yeah. I love, it. I love it. Well, tell us a little bit about you, who you are, where you live, what you were doing before you joined, what motivated you to join Project 90? Yeah. Um, I am a real estate broker. I live in Louisville, Kentucky, and I've really been the past two years kind of on a journey of awakening and figuring out what I want in the next phase of my life. And um, I knew that this was the next catalyst for me. I had kind of, um, I had told you I'd, I'd kind of done a little, little light digging online of alcohol free options and you just started popping up in my Facebook and I just gravitated towards it and I, and I made the call and I, I, I knew that I was ready, but I was scared to do it because I had tried to do it before and it didn't stick, but I knew that I was ready. And so I reached out to you. And what were you drinking? Uh, just tell us a little bit about what your drinking habits were that inspired you to, to reach out. Sure. Um, I am 41 now and I started drinking at 16 in high school. Have, it did very well in college to continue drinking. And throughout, um, you know, working in restaurants and throughout adulthood, I would say in the past few years, I was really just drinking wine. I would drink a few glasses a night. Um, and there near probably in the past year after that, before contacting you, I was drinking, you know, sometimes a bottle to two bottles of wine a night. And it, it was... I realize now it was out of, of some avoidance of things I didn't want to deal with in my life. Some just boredom. It was consuming entertainment. Um, and it was boredom. It was a habit that wasn't serving me. And I just got sick and tired of it. Yeah. And I, when I contacted you, the difference for me was it was a stepping into something exciting. It wasn't a giving up of something. It was look at this new life I can create. Look at these amazing people doing this. It was exciting. It was stepping into a new community, stepping into a new adventure and what can life look like, not a giving up of something before it always felt like I was giving something up and that's not what it felt like. It felt like I was gaining something. Yeah. Because a lot of mistakes that people, uh, the same mistake that a lot of people make is that they think they're depriving themselves of something fun and joyful when they have to give up alcohol versus what my methodology is, which is you're not depriving yourself of, of anything. Uh, you're giving yourself the gift of outstanding health and clarity and focus. And you said just before we got on this call that some of the benefits that you have got from being alcohol free was more clarity, more energy, confidence and connection of, of knowing you know, what you want. So just maybe just elaborate a little bit on that. When, once you started to be alcohol free this different way, what were some of the benefits that came up for you? Um, yeah, more clarity and more energy. It was waking up in the morning and feeling good. I mean, for so long, I, I, w it, I was just living in like this, and you don't even realize it when it's happening, but like the six out of 10, just kind of coasting through my days. And I didn't realize how much it was affecting me. So to be able to wake up and gain this momentum of energy and clarity and this feeling of before it was this feeling of sometimes just being wiped out and feeling like you were starting over and having to like catch up from the shit that you had missed for the past three days or whatever, mm -hmm. feeling like you had to catch up and, and it didn't feel that way anymore. So, and it's interesting the confidence part, you think that alcohol gives you confidence, but I realized 
how much confidence and real connection I had without it and experiencing people and going out and doing things without it really strengthened my own intuition of figuring out what I want, what made me feel connected. And that felt really good and really different. And it felt true, like true confidence. It didn't feel like hiding something or, or a fake buzz or confidence, which is what it was before. Yeah. Got it. Amazing. And, um, what was the what was one of the fears that you may have had coming into doing it this way into into you know my methodology in my program? Did you have a little voice in your head that's like, well, oh, maybe this won't work, or man, I'm investing money to be in this thing, and what if happens if I fall back into the old routine? Like, what were some of the fears that were going through your head? Yeah, I mean, when I said yes, I remember you saying, um, "Yeah, we're starting today," and I'm like let's not get crazy. The first call is on Monday. We're starting on Monday. I cried. I knew it was a huge deal because I knew I wanted to do it and I was going to do it. Um, the investment truly, I said to myself, if this is what is going to make you alcohol free, it doesn't matter. It's worth it. Whatever it is, it is worth it. I was scared I, it felt very, very big because I knew I wanted to do it and this felt different and I was scared and I just jumped in <laughs> because mm -hmm. I knew I needed, I tried to do it on my own before and it, it's, this felt different because the accountability and the community in the accountability felt very different. It felt, it didn't feel like I was out there on my own doing it and it, it just felt lighter. It felt fun and exciting and lighter to talk about it, to not give so much weight and heaviness to it and see that other people were going through the exact same thing. It, yeah, it was amazing. Obviously. I cause here I am. <laughs> yeah. And so what's life got planned for you now? Or what have you got planned for life now that you're alcohol free? I have, my life has changed so drastically. I just got back from Bali, Indonesia and Chiang Mai, Thailand. I'm leaving in three days to go camping out West. I'm going to Spain at the end of next month. Everything has changed. My relationships have changed. What I'm doing with my career is changing. I just have this passion and zest and excitement for life that I haven't felt in a very long time. And it just, it feels amazing. It's all changed. <laughs> I love that. And I'm so happy for you. I'm so energized for you. I've got a big smile on my face watching <laughs> you have a big smile on your face. <laughs> Is there and any... we've talked about this before. My skin has gotten better. I feel like it's going to keep, it's like you get healthier. I realize how much energy I have. I'm working out. I'm going to Orange Theory. You like the momentum you get, you just want to put healthier things in your body. I'm like not just naturally eating better. My hair's better. Like everything is changing. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Congratulations on the results you've got. And, and just finally, what would you say to someone who's watching you right now in this moment who is nervous and thinking about it and they're kind of like, oh, should I do it? Should I not do it? What would you say to, to that man or woman watching you right now? That it is worth it. Anything that your heart is pulling you towards to just trust and leap and it is worth it. I have tears in my eyes. It's almost just thinking about it. It is worth it. It's worth it. And you can do it. And it's way easier than you think it is. It really is. If you're ready to do it, it's worth it. Just take the leap. <laughs> well, Jessica Gaines Jabo, thank you so much. And thank you for playing full out as well. And you were such a positive influence in the group and you didn't just accept our coaching, but you also coached people. You may not have realized this because, but you showing up and you being alcohol free inspired people who were starting a little bit later than you to keep going on their journey. So while I'm sure that our methodology and our system inspired you to be alcohol free, you have also inspired those who came behind you to be alcohol free. And so for that, I thank you as well. Thank you. And it was amazing. You know, I still have connections. I'm staying connected with people in the group. So that, that part was really amazing as well. Thank you. Wonderful. Jessica Gaines Jabo, thank you so much. And uh, look forward to 
to following you on your alcohol freedom journey. Yes. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> See you. Bye.